that he's talking about, um, I don't know if it's Opus or something like that. Um, the robot that he has built, it, it has AI in it, so it can figure out tasks. It's already they've already got it to figure out tasks. Mm-hmm. So the whole idea is that you would have every home in the world would have a Tesla robot in it doing stuff that we don't want to do: making the bed, doing the laundry, cooking, mowing the lawn. And you know, right now he said, I think. It, on, on the shareholder thing, he said they're twenty grand right now. And then he's going to release it at that, and then you know, with cost and you know, factory and getting them, you know, because he's already got the factory built. Like he can he can mass do the robots, mass produce them, mass produce them, and he's he's a genius at figuring out factory, you know, because car car manufacturing is the hardest. Mm-hmm. And then you know, it's like scaling is really hard. It's easy to make this keyboard once. Yeah, it's hard to make it. A million times That's fast, right. you know, and efficient. Because now you're talking about sourcing, pricing, mm-hmm. you know, a mass amounts of employees. So the whole idea is to eventually have everybody would have a robot in their home, okay, a charging, just as they would have a Tesla in an ideal world. And what would it be doing in my house? Um, all of the tasks that you don't want it to do. Okay. So you know anything that you wouldn't like, go feed your chickens. You know, go water the chickens. Mow the lawn. um, Go mow the lawn. Yeah, Uh, take the dogs for a walk. Okay. You know all those different things, or play with the dogs. You know all those different things, like the Jetson. 